Okay, so I've got a scion here from a Honey Drops Mulberry. And I want to take this bud right here and I'm going to graft it onto this wild mulberry tree right here. So let's go ahead and give that a shot. Okay, so first thing I'm going to do is make a vertical cut. And then I'm also going to make a horizontal, I'm going to make a T like so. And if it's spring slash summer, you'll start to get some sap out of there. Not getting a lot of sap right now. Kind of surprising, but... Okay. Just going to get this started a little bit. Okay. And that's going to make a little pocket for our cutting to go in. We want to try and get that bud and make it into a little wedge shape. So I'm going to go at about a 45 degree angle underneath it, cut maybe halfway through like that. And then I'm going to do another 45 above it. And I'm going to cut down into the scion like so. And then I'm going to turn and go towards that other cutting. So very gently, just kind of gently work my way down. It's going to want to jump on you. So very carefully go through that node. Just apply a little steady pressure. It's going to want to slip. And we should be putting up the first cut. contact there. Okay. Our bud should be close to free. Let's go a little bit more. And it feels pretty loose. I think we got it. Okay. So there's our bud. It's from the side. Don't want to leave that out too long, don't want it to oxidize. So let's go ahead and get it in the spot. Okay. There we go. Okay. You can see how that slides in there. We're gonna use our bark lifter and kind of push it down. Keep this going a little bit. Okay, there we go. I think that looks pretty good. Next step, I have some parafilm. When you stretch it, it sticks to itself. That should do it. We'll keep an eye on this and hopefully that bud will grow right out of there. We're gonna make a T cut right in the bark, like so. We're gonna use our bark lifter. Get in there. Just like that. And let's try and slide this in there now. Can use the top of our
just like that. Let's see, kind of snug around there. Okay. Okay, we'll keep an eye on that and hopefully that'll heal up and we'll have our new growth right out of here. And that'll be a honey drops on a wild mulberry. <laughs>